Hey everyone, it's Sarah and today I am back with a huge home fragrance haul from Tri Triple Traders. So, um, it's funny, this was so, so sweet, but um, I guess they saw the video that I did where I hauled some Al Rahab oils as well as some Ard Al Zafiran spray perfumes and the Amir Al Oud Intense from Latafa. Um, they saw that video and they sent all of this stuff to me like as a thank you, which was so, so sweet. I of course never expect anything from companies and I'm happy to um, you know, speak highly of websites and companies that I do business with um, that are really, really amazing. And Triple Traders is really, really amazing. They have amazing prices. If you're looking for Middle Eastern fragrances, they are amazing. But anyways, they sent over a whole bunch. I didn't realize they had so much home fragrance and I am such a home fragrance junkie. I've always got incense going or a candle burning or I've always got wax melts burn going. I've got plugins in the wall. Like I'm just crazy for um, home fragrance. So I was so excited to see all of this because this is all new, kind of new stuff to me. But anyways, I'm gonna be quiet and I'm gonna jump right in. I'm gonna start with the with an oil, a perfume oil that they sent. So this is from a brand called Yasmine and this is called White Musk Tahara. Um, I will tell you guys, I love Middle Eastern White Musk perfumes and oils. They always, they're so, um, they're totally different from like white musk that that we think of, like Jovan white musk or um, the Body Shop white musk. Middle Eastern mu white musks are very different, um, and they're they've got a whole bunch of different ones. But anyways, this is a really beautiful kind of. It's like a I would say a fruity white musk, and it's amazing. Like the oil is so thick. Um, I don't know if I'll get it to focus without holding my hand up, but you guys can see like, holy cow, it is so thick. Let me see if I can get it. Oh, it smells so good. Well, yeah, I don't think I'll be able to um, get it to focus. Well, maybe I can if I cover my face. Yeah, it's so thick and beautiful. This will be a wonderful layering oil. It's very slightly, well not very, but it's slightly sweet. It sweetens up a little bit more as it warms on the skin. It's clean smelling, but it's also got a touch of floral to it. But yeah, it's kind of in between a clean laundry scent and like a light fresh floral with some sweetness. It's really beautiful, very unique. I've never smelled another white musk that smells like this. It's good, and as this one warms and dries down on your skin, it the cleanliness gets more pronounced. It's beautiful. So anyways, that one is called Yasmin White Musk Tahara, and I'm sure it's incredibly affordable. Um, I'll show you. Really pretty bottle too kind of like a rose gold bottle with this really pretty pattern on it. Yeah, so pretty. Okay, so that is the perfume oil that they sent. And then they sent a bunch of home fragrance sprays, which I'm so excited about this, about these. Um, I love keeping these in my bathroom. Who doesn't like freshener in their bathroom? Um, this first one is called Musky Chaco and this is amazing. It smells, these are all from that, the brand Yasmin as well. Let me show you the label. I will put the prices on the screen, the prices of everything on the screen for you. Um, but yeah, this smells, it smells just like Choco Musk from Al Rahab, like a super sweet, yummy vanilla, like vanilla heavy chocolate. 
oh my gosh, I was in heaven. I was like, oh my gosh, what? I can spray that all over my house and smell like, make my house smell like Choco Musk. I'm so excited. So yeah, that is the first one. That is called Musky Choco. It is amazing. Okay, next we have got this one here. This one is called Romantic Rose. These sprays, I will tell you guys, are so concentrated. You only need like one or two sprays and like one spray would fill up an entire room, really. They're very, very strong and concentrated. Yeah, this one, it's like, ooh, I want to spray it, but maybe I'll spray it on some paper to see if I can. This one is really pretty. This is kind of like a, this one smells kind of like a jammy rose to me. It's like a sweet kind of creamy rose. It's beautiful. This, I loved this one too. I love, um, like I like any kind of home fragrance, but my favorite thing is like gourmand. And this kind of gives me gourmand rose vibes, kind of like a jammy, like a sweet jammy rose. It's so good. So anyways, that one is called Romantic Rose. It's really nice. Okay, next we have um, this one here. This is Tangerine Coffee. And this is beautiful. This smells like it's really, really strong. It's like a really strong coffee note or coffee fragrance. But then with the brightness of citrus in the top, but you almost can't, like the citrus brings a brightness, but really all you can smell is coffee. It's a really, really beautiful, strong coffee scent. I love it. This is for my people out there that love the smell of coffee but don't like to drink it. So you would like your house to smell like coffee but you don't make coffee, so it never does. This would be great for that. You can spray this in your house and it will smell like you got a fresh brewed pot of coffee sitting somewhere. So anyways, that one is called Tangerine Cafe. It's amazing. I can't tell you guys like how strong these are too. Okay, next was one of my favorite. Well, they were all kind of my favorites. I love them all. But this one is called Smooth Vanilla. This is beautiful. This is, it smells kind of like the, um, it's kind of like Choco Musk, but without the chocolate. It's just a super yummy, creamy, sweet vanilla my favorite, like my favorite thing in the world. So that one is called Smooth Vanilla. It is amazing. Okay, and then the last room spray they sent is this one called, no sorry, Ooh La La. And this one is, this one is really, really strong. I think this was the strongest one. Yeah, this is definitely the strongest one out of the bunch, but that's just basically saying that this one is like nuclear because they're all really strong, but this one is like nuclear. This one smells, this one actually smells very Middle Eastern. It's like a beautiful, dark, like, I don't know, almost like a dark spiced, resinous fragrance, but with light, fresh, like purple spring florals. If you go by what is on the picture, I think those are tonka beans. There's some kind of a resin, like myrrh or frankincense, some kind of a resin, and then lilac. Lilac and then whatever that red, I'll show you guys the picture, <laughs> then you can see. Okay, so we've got tonka bean right here. We've got some kind of a resin right here. We've got some lilac, and then whatever this is. Whatever that red kind of leaf is. But yeah, this one is like nuclear, and I love the way this one smells. It reminds me of, it reminds me kind of of like a hippie shop. Like when you walk into a hippie shop and you can smell all of the resins and incense and all of that, that's what it reminds me of. I love it. So anyways, that one is called Ooh La La. How did I say that before? Ooh La La? <laughs> oh 
gosh, I'll tell you what. Okay, next they sent this. I am so excited to try this. I've never seen anything like this before. This is an electric incense burner, but for your car. So you plug it in, you plug it into your lighter, and then you turn it on. And I think, I haven't opened this yet. Yeah, this is so fun, you guys. So you're, the little, um, the part that goes into the lighter, it like straightens out. So then you just would plug it into your lighter hole. I think you would just put, and I'm going to show you the, um, I'm going to show you the incense that you would put in there. You put it in here, and I'm, I think the whole contraption kind of warms a little bit. So yeah, the whole contraption warms, and then it would, it's going to make your car smell amazing. So I'm super excited about this. I've never had anything like this in my car, and I'm so stoked. So yeah, I'm going to show you all of the burners that they sent first, and then I'll show you all of the incense. Okay, and then they sent a couple of incense burners for the house. And I've never had any burners like these either, so I'm really, really excited to try these. They've got different ones too. They've got, so the box has pictures of different ones. There are those ones, these ones, which I think is like the one they sent or that's in this box. They've got these ones, and then they've got these ones, which this one, this silver one is so cool. It looks kind of like a goblet, and it looks like it's feathers. It's really, really cool. Actually, I think, well, we'll see. I forget which one <laughs> is in here. Um, yeah, I'm super excited though, super excited. So I think with these ones, you just, um, I think with this, look how pretty that is. So pretty, and it's got like little jewels on it. It's so pretty. It's like having a little piece from another part of the world in your house. I just think it's so neat. It's just so fun to see like, I don't know. But anyways, so this um, little this little bowl thing comes out and it's got holes in it, and yeah, so you would I think you would put your chunk of incense in there and then light it um, and let it burn that way. So yeah, really really cool. So I'm super excited to try that. I haven't been able to try, like I, I sprayed all of the um, like air fresheners, but I haven't tried any of this incense yet because I've been waiting. Um, I wanted to show you guys first. And then they've got, they sent an electric incense burner. So this one is just like normal. You could probably put any kind of incense in there too, like a cone incense or some like what I'm gonna show you. This one is an electric one. And again, you can see there are like all different kinds of burners, which I think this one looks so cool. That one to me, it looks super medieval. Like again, like a medieval goblet or something. Really, really neat. And then this one, it's like a, another like goblet one. They've just got some really cool ones. And then this is the one that's in here. Yeah, and this one is electric. Again, I'm guessing that this one warms like warms up. So you've got your little um, dish in here, which is where you would put it. And I don't think you have to light it. I Again, I think the whole contraption like warms. Um, and it's got magnets on the top. So you've got your little power button down here. And then you just pull this off and you can see it's got four little magnets on there and it just sticks on. Like how fun is this thing? 
I love it. So yeah, I'm super excited to try these. Um, I will definitely keep you guys updated. And again, Triple Traders is so, so affordable. Um, you can get all kinds of fun stuff for really good prices. Okay, and then these are the, oh my gosh, I am dying to try this. I just read the ingredients and these have sugar in them. So they're gonna smell sweet as they burn, I think. So these are the incense that they sent and they sent four different kinds. Um, this one is called Mamul Asia. And I'll have to look up, I'll look it up. Um, I'll look these up as I'm editing and I will put on the screen if it says it smells like anything in particular. But anyways, these are like chunks of incense. Oh my gosh. So this is, it says incense, fragrance, and sugar. So I think these are gonna kind of smell a little bit sweet as they burn from that sugar. This one is beautiful. This one is, um, it's like a super clean floral. Perfect for this time of year. And you get the sweetness, like it smells kind of like sugar. Like sweetness from sugar. You can see sugar in the lid. It's beautiful. This one is a really, really clean floral. Okay, and then the next one we have, this one is called Mamul Ooh La La. Um, so this one matches the Ooh La La um, spray. It's like kind of Middle Eastern smelling. It's, it's like a resinous floral. It's really clean, very resinous, but also very bright, like lilac. It's really nice. I can't wait to burn these, you guys. I'm like dying. Um, yeah, I've been waiting to film this, so I haven't played with any of them yet, but I'm so excited. Okay, this one is called Mamul Arabia, and oh my gosh, this one smells, this smells like a really beautiful, sweet laundry detergent. Like super, super clean. Oh, it smells so good. Like sweet, clean, like better than laundry detergent though. Not like, it doesn't smell like an industrial laundry detergent. It just smells like sweet and clean, like fresh linen. It's beautiful. This was one of my favorite ones. So that one is called Mamul Arabia. It smells amazing. And then the last thing that they sent is this here. This one is called Mam Mamul at Taz Tazij and oh my gosh this I think this was not I think this one was my absolute favorite of the four because this smells like something to eat it smells like kind of like sweet nutty nougat or something like sweet nutty creamy like delicious, it smells like something you wanna eat. Oh, like vanilla, creamy vanilla nuts. Oh, it smells amazing. This is the first one I'm gonna burn naturally because I'm such a gourmand lover, but yeah, it looks like, um, I think what these are, I think they're little pieces of wood that are coated in incense and sugar, so. I think that that's what they are. Oh my gosh, I am dying, dying to, to try these. So anyways, yeah, those are the four incense, um, bottles of incense that they sent. And I am, oh, I'm so excited. So yeah, thank you so much to Triple Traders for sending all of this beautiful home fragrance. I am so grateful and so thankful it was so that it was like the sweetest thing ever. Just, it made my whole day and I'm so super excited to share it with you guys because I didn't even know they had home fragrance stuff. And yeah, after I already know that the room sprays are amazing, they're, oh my gosh, they're super concentrated and yummy smelling. 
and I will definitely keep you guys updated on the incense and I'll definitely keep you updated on the car incense. I'm so super excited about this. Um, yeah. So anyways, you guys, I do hope that you enjoyed this. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.